Chucky Hepburn inside touch to Stephen Crowell, isolated. Davis tries the other side, and he's good on that win. Inside look to Tyler Wall, feeds Crowell. Shot clock winding down, Crowell able to finish. We haven't really seen anything from Tyler Wall. At least he gets a catch here and could play with it. A siege hit for three, and maybe that's what they need. We need you to play. Tough shot, an offensive rebound pulled down, and it's blocked away. Jordan Davis ends up with the loose ball that was Bube Muma who had it blocked. You can see some frustration here from Greg Gard. Davis pops from three. So quick, he's able to get into the paint, open up shooting, open up threes for Lehigh. The shot clock winding down, Tyler Wall took that seal and took advantage of it. Kamari McGee lighting up the basketball. Now a baseline drive got knocked away by Tyler Wall. Here come the Badgers. Crowell's got it. Feels the double, hits Jordan Davis, and he knocks down his third triple of the first half. I like that term. It's a great term. Another turnover. Three straight possessions ending in turnovers for Lehigh. Wall, a little shake and bank, and the Badgers have the lead again. Open look, Gilmore passed it up. And now Chunky Hepburn looking for help. Feet inside, follow, there's Carter Gilmore. And that's why you see Greg Gard putting in you know, uh, Jordan Davis now. Hepburn got it into the hands of Carter Gilmore. 27-27 was the score at halftime in Iowa City on Sunday. Follow-away jumper here from Chucky Hepper. And you can kind of feel, right, like Chucky understands, end of the first half, we, get, we got to play better. Tyler Wall got out of the gate pretty quiet. Took him until about the 12-minute mark to really engage in the game. Klesman, active hands. He's been so good for this team. This brings a little bit of a, a fight. Transfer from Wofford at the game winner against Marquette. And Crowell goes to work. Hepburn one on one. Klesman now on the drive. Gives it off to Crowell. Leads all scores with 15. Crowell trying to be physical in the paint. And he's got eight points. Allowing 10 fast break points today. Transition defense, not what it was on Sunday in Iowa City. In a team in Iowa that plays faster than Lehigh. Kyle Resigen needed a big three and got it. Yeah, kind of right place, right time, or wrong place, wrong time if you're a Resigen. Running into Parallel. A Resigen for three. And the lead for Wisconsin. And Gilmore did such a great job on Philip Robracho over the weekend. Wall looking for help. There's three around the Klesman now for three. Got it. And poked away by Kamari McGee. Over three minutes since Lehigh last scored a bucket. Cross court pass intercepted by a CJ. Wall on the take. Here's a siege on the curl, and he hits the jumper. Kamari McGee hits Crowell as he was coming around off the baseline, and Crowell continues his strong second half. The siege looking for space, and he hits the runner. He's in double figures. Carolyn's done a nice job on Crowell. Wall to Klesman. Three is good by Klesman. Hepburn. What a move. Klesman. No whistle. Still finished. Career high 
for him. He has 14.